four down. And sorry, I'm going a little slow, just making sure everybody's stuff stays nice and organized and goes to the right place. So we are down to the end of our one third of the way through because there's 15 packs total. First little stack here, and it's going to Ileana. All right, Ileana, Sunkern. We're looking for Sunkern Play-Doh. And hopefully not a Beedrill. We've seen a couple Beedrills now. I heard whoever gets the most dupes wins. Whoever gets the most dupes is the winner. Is the big winner. I'm missing Sunkern. I think Wobbuffet Hollow is in this or is in Soul Silver. You know, I'm not sure, Ileana. Is that the one you're missing? Or did you trade for a Wobbuffet Hollow? I feel like you traded. But maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that was someone else. So, mirror foil, energy. Yeah. Feeling pretty good about the wrappers so far. Haven't destroyed any of them at all. Okay, we have Remoraid. We have Skip Plume. Oh, you did it! SpaceX! Very nice! There's your Sunkern. Alright, now you just need Wobbuffet. We're off to a good start. All right, Totodile. And I always this always throws me off that for Alligator is not a rare, just an uncommon. So all right, you got for Alligator and Totodile. And art featuring for Alligator. There's Professor Oak. And Fire Energy. Did you already get Fire Energy? Somebody did earlier. I don't think it was you, though. So I think you're good. Yeah, that's right. You got the Lugia. Now you got them both. Lugia and ho oh All right. Here is your non-holo rare. Oh, it's Primeape Play-Doh. Do you have that one? That's amazing. You probably have it, but it's pretty cool you still got another Play-Doh. Mirror Foil looks like it's an electric type. And it's flaffy. Look at that art. Oh, I love it. Super shiny, too. These mirror foils are... I see why they call them mirror foils. They are so shiny. And in the back, your hollow rare card is Noctowl with a nice hollow squirrel right, right in front of his face. Actually. Not too bad. Okay. Liking the different, different hits we're getting. Fresh knocked owl there. Definitely gotta get that sleeved up. The Flappy is adorable. I think I like the Flappy more than the knocked owl, actually. And she is a, uh, she's just a common, but she is a mirror, so the mirrors are always gonna be slightly more, you know, valuable than the, their normal version. Every single card in the set comes in a mirror foil, which is a craziness to try and complete the set. Alright, that was pack number five. We are a third of the way there. The wrapper. How long would a package take to Brooklyn, New York from Japan? That's what you're asking? Um, it depends on the type of shipping used, but if, if it's from me, I use a type of shipping called airmail. Not like standby airmail, like actual airmail. So usually seven to 14 days. I'd say the average is about 10 days, maybe 9 days. But it completely depends on a lot of things. Alright, pack number 6, Alec is up. Alec, you still here? Best of luck, I know you're thinking about taking it sealed. But it's hard to want to keep it sealed. I love Ampharos Evil Line because of Pokemon Coliseum. I love Pokemon Coliseum. That was such a fantastic game.
Hey, Rated M. Mature 17, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Came at a good time. We're just doing some vintage stuff. I mean, I think you came at a good time if you like vintage. I know it's a little slow, which is, I think, why some people aren't as into it, but that's okay. We don't, you, we don't do it that often. All right, so this one is the um, energy, and this is the mirror foil. Larson's here. Perfect. This is you. This is your pack. First pack, I think you have two. Let's get you some good stuff. We got Remoraid. Uh, yeah, our bot's not working tonight, Rated M. Which is dumb. So yeah, nothing's working. Makes the chat not as fun, but it is what it is for now. I'm hoping I can get it back up tomorrow. We got a star you with that fantastic artwork. There's a Stantler. We did get a mirror foil Stantler a minute ago. We got Bill, also known as Masaki in Japanese. Tauros with the super weird art. I actually think, is that the same artist that did a bunch of stuff on a tag bolt set? I feel like that might be the same person. He's been around forever. Professor Oaks, something or other advice, maybe? Something like that. And another dark energy. This time going to Alec, though. Hopefully you like Umbreon. Alright, non-hollow rare is a Beedrill. Are you serious? That's our third Beedrill. Third Beedrill. WM Dragon 31 on Instagram. How's it going? Doing pretty good. We're just doing a vintage break right now. Heart Gold Soul Silver. So this is like 10 years ago. 10 years old packs. Maybe a little older than that. It might be 12. And our mirror foil is another Flappy. <laughs> All the funny doubles. Beedrill and Flappy. Okay. Is this going to somebody different? That's all that really matters. Alright, good luck, Alec. I hope you like Flappy. In the back, what do we got? Is a grass type. I don't know, maybe this set just had a high amount of grass types. Is it just me? We're getting a lot of grass type hollows. It is Shuckle! Which is a double, so I'm glad it's going to someone else. What am I doing for 2019? You know, I don't, I don't, I don't know. You mean what I'm doing for New Year's Eve? Probably eating and sleeping. I was thinking about streaming, but I don't know if uh, enough people will be around or will want to hang out on a stream on New Year's Eve. But maybe, maybe, I guess it's a possibility. Who doesn't like Flaffy, right? Who doesn't like a cute pink sheep? How can you not like that? And everyone likes Shuckle, right? He's got like a fan following, a cult following around him. Which I thought was pretty cool. Everyone loved it when they, we got the uh, Shuckle GX card. What set was that? Fairy Rise, I think? Something like that? Alright, good stuff. Good stuff, Larson. You got another pack coming up soon. Alright, that was number six. On to number seven, going to Sam. Sam's probably asleep, Diamond, but if you are here, you are up. Pack number seven. Right there. Oh, and of course, almost. Slip that into your stuff there, Alec. Everyone gets wrappers. Everyone gets the wrapper. That was a god pack because of Shuckle. Shuckle makes a good makes it a god pack. Flaffy and Shuckle, the dream team, is true though. I'm having a hard time remembering what you can get in this set versus what you could get in the uh, Soul Silver set. Because when we did this break before, um, we did it together with Soul Silver, so it got all mixed up in my head. All mixed up. All right, energy and mirror foil. 
There we go, there's a Mareep. I was about to say, when are we gonna get some Mareep? Some Ampharos? We did get an Ampharos. I think that's our first uh, Mareep, though. To go with the Flappies. Then we got a Slowpoke. So I, okay, so that Slow King Hollow is in this set. We have a Fampy. Spiro. Mantine. Blissey. Look at the art on the Blissey. I love it. And this is just a Pokeball, I think. But look at the art. In Japanese, Pokeballs are called Monster Balls. So just a Monster Ball goods card. And another Fire Energy. Okay. But Sam hasn't had a pack yet, so it doesn't really matter. All are new for him, even if we double up. This is why a group break can be good. Because you guys can also trade, too. And in the end, hopefully save a little money than if you just bought them all yourself. Blissey is cute. I'm loving the Blissey. Alright, non hollow rare is Slow King to go with that. Or just kidding, Slowbro. That's not Slow King. Slowpoke and Slowbro. And our next card should be the Mirror Foil, which is a Mareep. Awesome. Getting flappy, and now we're getting a Mareep in a Mirror Foil with the awesome art yet again. Can you order packs unopened? You know, I don't do a lot of sealed packs anymore. I used to offer sealed boxes and stuff, but after the whole pack shortage craziness that's been happening, I kind of stopped and kept everything for opening on stream. In a vintage break, though, you can request um, something sealed most of the time. All right, here is your hollow. It looks like it's fire type, fire type. Oh, Arcanine. Oh, I love it. Oh, I'm so jealous. I need this card. I still need this card in my own collection. We gotta take a minute to look at that. That is a beautiful card. Going to Sam. Sam, you might have some people after you for trade, because that is a nice one. Such a beautiful card. I would say my favorite hit so far. And uh, I mentioned it before, but just in case you guys weren't here, Legend Series, super fun. They, they do a lot of attention to detail in the art, and one thing they do is any Pokemon that has an evolutionary stone, like Arcanine here, you will see it in the artwork. So in this case, we've got the Firestone. And that will be true for all of them, like Raichu. Sometimes they have to look a little harder, sometimes they hide it to the side, but it is in every single artwork. That was a true god pack. Agreed. Now that was a true god pack. Diamond, congratulations. As usual, Diamond coming in with all the killer hits. I feel like, Diamond, your luck is either super awesome or super not awesome. Like, you'll go hitless and then you'll just get something amazing. Definitely my favorite card. I feel like uh, I might have to take a picture of that one. For Instagram. Make sure you guys follow on Instagram if you want to see pictures of uh, the cards we pull over here. Alright. Number seven. We're about halfway through the break now. Up next, we got pack number eight. Lucky number eight. Going to Alec. Alec, you had two pretty close to each other. In a row here. It's kind of fun not knowing what you could pull. I haven't memorized all the cards for this set, so I don't actually know all the hollows. I mean, I don't know them when I see them, but I don't remember which ones you can get. It's kind of fun. So if you like the song. Yeah, with the playlist, the songs we're playing, guys, is just literally non-copyright music. We just gotta be safe at this point because our videos are getting muted. So, I'm just going non-copyright all around. Oh, is there a chance I know the name? You know, I probably could have checked, but it's a live channel and now it's, now it's, but I liked it too. I have a sneaking suspicion we might hear it again, so if we hear it again, let me know. I can check. I don't know when, eventually, but I've noticed some of these channels that play music 24 hours a day will loop sometimes. They start to loop. Can 
I show you a drawing I just finished? Sure, I don't know where you can show me. You can send me a message, or if you want to drop a link, I can try to click on it. Hey, Papa Davis, how's it going? Happy holidays to you. It's been so busy. For me, anyway. Okay, I want to do this right. So, this one is the energy, which goes up here. I don't know why I'm so confused. You'd think I know how to do it by now. There we go. In 2020, I will be 30 years old. And do you have a sealed pack collection? Just curious. I have a small sealed pack collection. And in 2020, you will be 30 years old. That's almost my age. Pretty close. 2020 is so soon now. <laughs> and look who it is again. It's Flappy again. Of course it is. There we go. There's something new. We got a Jinx. We got a Fampy. Fampy and Flappy. Another Stantler. Quellfish. And a Donphan. You got the Donphan and the Flappy. Let's see here. What is this photo? Your. Let's see what it is. Got it loading. We got Tauros from that super weird artist that I actually kind of like. Hey, it's Minnie Mouse. Are you doing some Disney art? I like it. Of course, I like Disney a lot too. I like Pokemon more, but I also really like Disney. Taros. Oh, and Espeon on the Psychic Energy, which is pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Who's this going to again? Alright, oh, Alec, Alec. Did you get Umbreon on the last one? So you got Umbreon and Espeon on the Energy? Alright. And your non hollow rare is a Weezing. Something different. And your mirror foil is Growlithe. Yes. Yes, I love it. We got Arcanine. We got the mirror foil Growlithe. We're definitely not going to see every card in a mirror foil because there's just too many. And there's only one per pack. All right. And your hollow rare is Smoochum. You got a Jinx and a Smoochum in the same pack. Nice to see something different, though. And I love the hollow pattern. Anyone else love that hollow pattern? It's just so nostalgic. You know, I honestly can't tell how many people are here right now. I'm seeing like three different numbers for how many people are watching, but hopefully some people will check out the video later because this set is too cool. It's too nice. I'm just leaving up the uh, non hollow rare too, just in case. Pudding Mitai. You wanna see you wanna see Jigglypuff? Is Jigglypuff in this set? I don't know if you if you speak English. But Um yeah, I'd love to see Jigglypuff too. I have a feeling she's in the other half though. I'm getting the sense she might be in the the one the Lugia half that we don't have. Because, of course, Lugia is more popular than ho oh Okay, Tichi, you see 33, too. That's what I see on one spot. But my other spot says 9, which is, like, super low. I feel like there's more than 9 people in the chat. Alright, so that was spot number 8. Lucky spot 8. And Sam up next. With pack number 9. I think this is Sam's second pack. I know it might be a pain, but can you sleeve the energy too? If not, that's cool. Sure, I can do that. That is fine with me. I think, um, just so you know, uh, when it ships, I'm pretty sure 99% of the time we just sleeve up, unless, you know, Unless Ginkgo forgets or something like that, because he doesn't know. But um, we try to sleeve up any pack fresh vintage, all the cards. I'm just not sleeving them all on camera because it will take way too long. <laughs>